I didn't get a good enough look at you back there. Now I see why my guards had trouble with you. Well, they weren't exactly easy. I'm sure they aren't what mortals like you are used to. You must be someone special. Thank you, uh, your majesty. A simple Persephone will do just fine in my realm. Formalities are for the boring. Isn't that what they say? So, Elysium belongs to you? After the rude introduction I gave you, I can't blame you for not knowing. Let me apologize. Ross can attest. Usually he's the one that does the biting. He would want you to forgive me too. Tell me your name. Let's begin again. On the right foot, this time. No hard feelings. My name's Cassandra. Then I give you my official welcome, Cassandra. Let me tell you what's customary around here. This place is mine. I know every flower, every face. I alone let them in. But there's something here I don't want. You mean me? No. There's a beast loose in Elysium, and it belongs to Hades. If it gets to him that his wife stole one of his immortal mounts, it'll be a disaster. But I didn't steal it. I won't go near the things. They brought me down here in the first place. No, someone wants me to look back, and I need that horse gone. The Hades? I'll take it you aren't a happy couple. He's tried, of course, to bond with me. But what can he expect out of a prisoner? Love? That's just stuff of legend. You think someone would do this to you? It's highly unlikely the thing got in here on its own. I have to remember Elysium is my paradise, not everyone else's. I'll see if I can find the horse for you. What does it look like? You know it when you see it, trust me. Not only is the beast immortal, but he is terrifying. Horses don't scare me. Has anyone seen him lately? I heard screams coming from the Asphodel Alboritum. Perhaps he's scaring civilians. Bring it to my stable boy, the jockey of Artemision. He'll know how to send it galloping back to the nightmare it came from. Don't come any closer. You're all scaring my horse. He's just a gentle creature. Have you seen your horse? The others ran away screaming. Leave it to a blind man to see what's right in front of him. Of course I haven't seen it. I'm sorry. These are hard times. I'm afraid I won't make them any easier. I have to take that horse from you. You can't! 
First Persephone takes my sight, and then you take Orphe? Our friendship was instant. I heard the neigh of a fierce horse. I approached him, unafraid. And he licked my palm. Did you say Persephone blinded you? She had one of her godly soldiers fry me with fire. It was punishment for telling others what I thought of this paradise, and somehow it got back to her. Said I didn't deserve to see the beauty she created. She's not supposed to be in Elysium. Are any of us in a realm that boasts perfection but shows only deceit? Have pity. Let him stay with me. All right, you can keep him. But it's a risk. You could be caught. A risk I'm willing to take. Oh, Orphe, when we're safe, we shall ride together in the fields. Take it. I know Hades will be missing his beast. Everything's taken care of. Hmm. I'll have one of my generals check up with my stable boy. I hope the creature didn't scare him too much. Not at all. Rest assured. Better pay that stable boy a visit to cover my tracks. The jockey of Artemision. Nice horses. I keep them clean and pretty, just like Elysium. I tended horses in my old life, too. Then you're just the boy I need to talk to. I have a favor to ask. What favor? If Persephone or any of her people ask, I need you to tell them that I brought a big, scary horse to you. A scary horse? We don't have those here. Then you'll have to pretend. There is Drachmi for you if you do. You're silly. We don't need Drachmi in Elysium. You're sure you're from around here? Of course, I knew that. No matter what, you need to do what I say. Why do you want me to lie? Because if you don't, I'll make sure all of your horses get out of their pens and run away to Tartarus. Understand? Tell them I was here. Fine. Just leave my horses alone. Thank <laughs> you. 